Hey y'all, welcome to my curls. I'm so glad you're here. It is a holiday weekend and y'all, I'm spending my day in this lounge chair right here at the pool. It is gonna be a beautiful weekend, sunny, like 85 degrees, and I have nowhere to be. My number one goal this weekend, and it's a three day weekend, is to try to get Pollux in the pool. Y'all have been so interested and sent so many comments to me about you want to see his first swim in the pool, and I'm going to try to get that done this weekend. So stay tuned, and I'm just going to share my holiday weekend with you as Randy and I chill. Brecken is actually at the beach, so she's not here, and I'm going to share our weekend with you. Grab a margarita, grab a beer, grab something. Welcome to my curls on a holiday weekend poolside. Hey, Pollux, buddy. Oh, see y'all, he does lift his leg. Finally, he lifts his leg. That was proof. You all know Pollux. I adopted him from the animal shelter. I guess it's been five months ago now. And this is our first pool day of the year. Pollux has never seen a swimming pool. And I'm getting in the pool today and I'm gonna see what Pollux does. I really, really hope that he gets in the pool with me. We'll see likes to get under the lounge chair. And I think it's because he's got his toy out here. He likes to hang out with me. He knows I'm in the lounge chair, so he wants to be out high side. And it's, isn't that sweet? He just gets in there and hangs out with his toy. Are you coming out, buddy? Are we gonna get into pool today, Pollux? Hey, let's put our feet in. Want to? Come on, let's put our feet in. We'll to put our paws into pool. Oh, taking his toy. Off he goes. Oh, zoomies. Zoomies with the toy in his mouth. But look, he loves to just lay in the yard. He's got, oh my, three toys. He has a ball, a bone, and a big toy out here. And he is just happy as a clam hanging out in the yard. What you doing? Oh, Maxie, let's show him our day lilies. Our day lilies bloomed this morning too. Came outside and there they were. I love the day lilies and all of these are just gonna be filled with blooms in these two. But yeah, they popped open this morning. My fountain grass. This stuff, just in the three weeks or three or four weeks since I did my last video, look at this. Let me show you how tall it is. I'm five two and look at the fountain grass. It is. Some of it taller than me at this point, and this stuff gets about seven feet tall. Can y'all see him? I'm gonna get the pool, and we'll see if I can get him in here with me. Oh, he going into the yard. Pollux! Come on, let's get into pool. Come on, Pollux! He not interested, he's dead. Well, I'm calling him and calling him. He's just milling around the yard. He he doesn't like when the camera's on him, so he's completely ignoring me when I call his name. Come on, Pollux, come get into pool. Buddy, why are you ignoring me? <laughs> he knows I'm trying to get his attention to get in the pool, and he's completely ignoring me. So for now, I'm just gonna hang out on my float, try again later. Moo, you want in? I was, oh, what you got? Okay, Pollux has got a squirrel. He ain't coming out here. Oh no, Maxie wants out now, so Cheetos. Look at, look at his tail. You're, you're what you got, Pollux? Is this squirrel? Oh, he's torn. He hears the Cheeto bag. Oh, here he come for the Cheeto. Pollux loves Cheetos and so does the Maxer. So does Randy. Cheeto break. You want to get into pool, Pollux? Where are you going? Come on. Come get into pool with me. Oh. Hey, Pollux. You want to get into pool, buddy? He said no. He didn't want to get into pool today. He was too busy running and playing and he took a Judy in the yard, y'all. He laid down, propped his head up against the fence, and took a nap in the yard. 
He's so happy, so relaxed. He's just enjoying his day, listening to the birds and chasing squirrels and I don't know, didn't want to get in the pool. Wasn't happening today. Tomorrow, we're gonna to try again. But right now, it's about 3.30 and I have to go to the ice cream shop. So I gotta head in, get cleaned up and go roll some ice cream tonight. But I'll see you again tomorrow. We'll try it again. Hey y'all, welcome to day two of my long holiday weekend. Whew, it is Sunday. I am so worn out. Today, I got no pumpkin. If y'all ever heard that, got no pumpkin, I am exhausted. I live in the South, y'all, in Kentucky, and I know so many of you all live all over the world, and I use slang terms and say things that you're so confused. You don't understand what I mean? So this is Sunday morning. Last night was Saturday. Ice cream shop was open, and this time of year, especially on a holiday weekend, the ice cream shop is so busy. I call it screaming busy. We have people lined up out the door down the street. It just gets bonkers. And by the time I get home from working at the ice cream shop on a Saturday night, on Sunday, I am exhausted. But I woke up to a sunny, beautiful Sunday. Uh-oh. Y'all see this? So, dogs are on the other side of that fence. The family that lives next door to us have dogs. And when their dogs come out, my dog's got to bark, especially Maxie. He'll bark a second, then he'll go in. The ice cream shop is open today, but I don't work. It is so nice. I'm so excited to just have the entire day to be able to sit outside in the sun, read my book. Let me show you what I'm reading. Do y'all read? I love to read. I'm reading this right now. I'm just looking forward to hanging out by the pool. Like I told y'all the earlier, Brecken, Brecken is actually at the beach. So Randy and I are just home alone all week. I've already been to the grocery store this morning. So we've got snacks, we have beer, we're gonna have gin and tonics, we're gonna grill dinner, and I've got pup cups in the freezer for Maxie and Pollock. So they're gonna get to enjoy some of those today. Randy's gone inside to make me some sort of cocktail. I don't really know. We wanted to do a gin and tonic. Turns out we don't have any gin, so he's whipping up, I don't know what it's gonna be, some form of tequila, pomegranate tequila, lime juice, seltzer water, Perrier water, sparkling water, something, I don't know. But I'm hot, I'm ready for a cocktail. There is no telling what is in this cocktail like i don't even know look what randy's done he well, is like the mess. cocktail master sir hey did you you can't just come in here and steal your pup cup Pollux. <laughs> i have the pup cups out on the counter getting the chill off and i came in to find this guy what are you doing were you trying to steal a pup cup Pollux? i'm getting them guys they have to get to chill. <laughs> you want to get up there too? They have to get to chill off first. We'll go outside and we'll do our pup cups. Hold on. Oh, oh my goodness, you're so close to me. Oh. Mm, the pup cups. way faster than Maxie. He's got a bigger tongue. He does. I mean, he licks that whole thing with one swipe. Okay, take a break. Just take a break for a sec. Get off of him. Okay. You gotta take a break. You're real cold. Oh, Maxie's got his chewings going. Maxie goes lick, lick, chew. Lick, lick, chew. Okay. Gosh. Ah! Is that good? Oh, Maxie got it. Look at that. Just want it? Here, take it. How was it, Maxer? Was it good stuff, Moo? How was it, Pollux? Was that a good pup cup? 
Maxie's gonna lick his lips for 10 minutes. It gets all in his beard. Are you looking for the little scraps? They're not anymore, buddy. Pollux, you want to get in the pool? Hey, that's my drink. Hey, hey, Pollux, that's my cocktail. What a difference a day makes. Look at this. This is the one I showed you all yesterday. But look at these. This has all happened today, Sunday. Look at the blooms that have come out in just one day with all the sunshine. Oh, I love my day lilies. Are you checking out my stuff, buddy? Oh, my. Well, what you doing? <laughs> so, it has been a day. One big, fat, lazy Sunday on a holiday weekend. It is 6 o'clock, I think. And we are just now starting dinner on the grill. Randy and I went inside and lay down and fell asleep. We took a Judy. I never take a Judy. I never have an opportunity to take a Judy, but I took a Judy. And for those of you that do not know what a Judy is, you'll have to watch my video, Get to Know Me, 25 Interesting Facts. I'll link it right up here. I got a good Judy this afternoon. So I am just woke up. I'm dazed and confused from a little nap, but we're getting ready to put dinner on the grill. We have had no luck with Pollock's he knew something was up every time i tried to get him to come to me in the pool wasn't having it pollock spent the majority of his day out in the yard in the shade taking a judy of his home we got citronella fuel in them to keep the bugs away pollock what are you doing he loves to get in the fountain grass i'm gonna chill and watch dad make dinner Oh, dirt our poor boy. He cooking his dinner, Moo. Mm. We got red peppers, grilled chicken with ch just this chili caramel sauce we get in Puerto Vallarta, corn in the cob, and this is potatoes and onions. Mm, we gotta take the trash out. It's gonna get stinky. You're stinky. Mm -mm, no, I took a start. Well, good morning, y'all. I just got out of bed. Literally, it's six thirty. It's Monday morning, Memorial Day, and I haven't spoken to anybody what yet. But you all, this is my pool hair from yesterday. But I wanted to start recording this now because I want to show you something that I got Pollux. Sorry, my voice. In my last video where you all got to spend the day with me, I showed you that I bought Pollux a snuffle mat. And he, I'm getting ready to feed him his breakfast on his snuffle mat and I wanted you to see it. <laughs> I went from the pool, fell asleep on the couch last night and got in bed. This is what my hair looks like. Pollux wakes up in the morning super, super skippy. He eats his breakfast really fast in the mornings. I was on Amazon looking for a dog puzzle and I happened across this snuffle mat and you put it down and you put their dry food in the snuffle mat and they sniff and they forage and try to find their food. And so I thought this sounds exactly like something I need for Pollux, so I bought it. Normally Pollux would eat his breakfast um, in about 20 seconds. It takes him about six or seven minutes and he really enjoys his breakfast on the snuffle mat. Okay. So look, he's already excited. So you got the mat down. Are you ready for this, Pollock? And you just wait. Okay, buddy. See how the food is just embedded down in this little mat? He's just looking for it. Right, buddy?
And y'all, since I have had this, Pollux has never left a single kernel in here. He's, he's really good. What are you looking for now, buddy? Mm. Are you going to give it another sniff? Are you going to give it a once over? Mm. Oh, I'm drinking my coffee. What? So let me tell you what's happening today. My sister-in-laws are coming over with their fur baby, Nelson. Nelson is, I think, three. He is like an 85-pound golden retriever. And he is coming over to play with Pollux. It's going to be hot. Yes, it's going to be hot. Nelson loves to swim. They take him to the pool all the time. So we're hoping Pollux will see Nelson in the pool and Pollux will get in the pool too. Pollux, look. Nelson's here. <gasps> Nelson's here to play. Yay, Nelson. Say hi, Nelson. <laughs> Yay. Look how fluffy he is. He just had a haircut, so he's bald. Oh, there he is. <laughs> go, 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 go. Are you swimming, Nelson? Oh, what? Well, he died for stuff. What are you doing, buddy? Are you just watching Nelson? Alex, are you going to get into pool with Nelson? <laughs> he likes that. Oh, he's going to jump. It looks like he's going to jump. Yeah, are we gonna do it? Right on my tail, Nelson. Nelson, you're being so good. Bye. Bye, Nelson. Bye. Thanks for coming swimming. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, I say bye, Nelson. So the closest Pollux got to the pool was a bath. Look at him. He's trying to dry himself off on the door. <laughs> Tell what him. What are you doing? <laughs> Did you have a bath, Pollux? How are you doing? Did you get a bath? Pollux, did you have a relaxing weekend? He's all fluffy where he got a bath. His booty is all fluffy. <laughs> I think that's a wrap on a long holiday weekend. My mission, however, to get Pollux in the pool was a fail. He was not having it. He wanted no part of the pool. He enjoyed playing with Nelson and Nelson had a ball in the pool. Pollux, maybe he, it's not his thing. Maybe he doesn't have water dog in him. We'll see, we still got a long summer ahead of us. But I am relaxed, I got a little sun, I'm rejuvenated and I'm ready for the summer season at the ice cream shop. Starting tomorrow, we are on summer hours. We are open six days a week nine and ten hours a day and it is that way until late october so i'm ready to go i'm ready to roll some ice cream i hope you all had a long happy relaxing holiday weekend and until next time i'll see you later